Sticks and Stones, Indomitable Will, and Silver Ticket. Let us reroll Sticks and Stones. Young and Wild and Free. You think I'll win streak? I'll win streak if I go Ginsu's. I can win streak if I go Ginsu's for sure. If I go Ginsu's on Olaf, I think I can easily win streak. Young and Wild and Free is good if you win streak. Alright, frick it, I'll take it. Oh, nice. Yeah, if I go Ginsu's on Olaf, I can easily win streak. It's very strong. I don't have Pentakill, I don't have Heart Steel, <laughs> which is a little bit unfortunate. We are one off on both of them. But that's A okay. Do we buy this Corky too? Yeah, the Olaf is very strong with Ginsu's, right? As long as you have Bruiser active. Ideally, we would have Pentakill active. Well, ideally you would have a Bruiser Olaf, and then you would have four Bruiser, right? That's the that's the most that's the strongest. It's pretty much the strongest early game you can get. The Katarina has some heal reduction, that's why I'm healing way less. So this guy has the team to beat me. Oh, that's that's exactly the team to beat me, isn't it? Okay, I don't really give a frick because I get hard steel. Okay, that's good. We got Harsh Seal. Do we raise those stakes? I think we raise those stakes, brother man. Are we just leveling here? No, we can't level. <laughs> In which world can I level? I do not have the money to level. I don't think I care about this guy. I think I care about her more. Because I can play Super Fan. Super Fan is good here with Olaf. Gives him a Sterox. Very good. Alright, guys. Nice, we win. So what we do want to do, what we ideally, what ideally happens now is we get a four win streak, okay, quadruple win streak, because that is gonna allow us to have a lot of health left and then raise the stakes, you know, and then we might have a game at hand. We can get a deep cash out, 250 stacks, let's say, and we're good to go, right? If we get five hard steel, we can get 500 stacks. And you know what? Since now we can just sell this guy, man. And we can put the Ginsu's on this guy. The plot is thickening. Thickening, sickening. Now the question is do we play Bruiser or Sentinel? I think we play Bruiser, right? Or do we play Sentinel? I would say Sentinel might be more useful because he's a two star. Do we just go do we go for a belt on him? Now let's just wait. I don't think I ever sell the Yone, right? Because I have a very high chance to get five, uh, five hard steel here. I just need a hard steel headliner, which you know isn't the highest chance. I'll just level. I'll just pre-level. Isn't the highest chance, but you know, if it happens, it happens. We can also just win streak hard steel. <laughs> I don't mind that either. The problem is we have a Ginsu's for the late game, which is just so trash, right? That is quiet trash. I think I'm going for an even shroud anyway, right? I think I'm going for an even shroud here. Let's go! Oh, I forgot about my thing! <laughs> okay, Loki, I would have taken the same thing. <laughs> I forgot about my freaking augment, guys. Classic. El Clasico, guys. I forgot about my freaking thingy, guys. <laughs> I always forget about this mother trucker. Okay, I do like an even shroud here, honestly. I do not mind the even shroud. The even shroud. Frick the Yone man, just let him die. He does nothing anyway. Without items. Okay, so the problem is, can we even raise the stakes? We might not be able to because we're getting too strong. I think we're actually very strong now. So we might not be able to raise the stakes. And that is not good, is it? Well, it's fine. If I, if I keep win streaking, I'm also in a really good position, right? 
Okay, so we don't want this guy. We want Aphelios. Our steel. Holy frick. I mean, it's just so well deserved, no? It's just so well deserved. Uh, question. Do we go for 3 star Aphelios? Nah, that unit is too trash, man. That unit is just not even a unit, man. Alright, we hit uh, hard steel, 5 hard steel at stage 2. Stage 2, 5 hard steel. That ain't bad, is it? This guy is raising the stakes, so you know what? I don't think I'm raising the stakes. I think I'm good, guys. I don't think I'm raising the stakes. You feel me? I think we're good on that front. We're just gonna win streak with 5 hard steel and keep cashing out. Like a boss. Like a freaking baboos, guys. Now, we're not raising those stakes, guys. Look, 40, 40 stacks. I'll take that. I don't want to make myself weaker just to just to um, lose against this guy. Because this guy is very weak. Look at him. He has vampirism as well, so he benefits from dropping low because it gives him more health. And look how weak he is, right? I don't want to loot. I don't want to sell my uh, my Aphelios and stuff. It's just not worth. It. Oh my goodly goodness, guys! I mean, don't mind if I do, brother man. Don't freaking mind if I do. You smell me? Do not mind if I do. We will take it. This is okay. We are a little bit broke, but we will save a lot of HP while cashing out hard steel. That is a very, very deadly combo for my opponents. Oh, now now they're making it too obvious. Oh, they're making it too obvious, guys. Oh, uh, a tier for my Ezreal as well. Oh, don't mind if I do. Oh, don't mind if I do. Do we level here? No, that is way too expensive. Okie dokie, guys. Let's um, chill. We are chilling. You can get that tier. Right? Right. And then you can be on the outskirts. Protecting my even shroud, my dude. And we're good to go, yeah? Ain't too bad, guys. Ain't too bad. We level next turn. We play Bruiser. We have him ready to be deployed. It will only cost us 12 gold next turn. So we're not gonna level now. 16. Paying 16 for 14 XP. Are we winning this? I'm not sure. Remember, guys, Aphelios is very, very worthless. It's a very bad unit. Like, a really bad unit. I cannot stress that enough. So, yeah. But, I mean, Ginsu's is pretty good on him. He can get those stuns out, like a boss. Yeah, he's getting those stuns out. Yeah. All right, not bad. And what happens here? Boom! Ay, 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 ay. I like blistering strikes because it seems like I will not get a rep up, huh? It seems like I will never get a rep up. So I really like blistering strikes here. I think we'll grab that real quick. 12 to level. Play that Olaf. And I think we're gonna have to sell this guy because we need to make 30, otherwise I'm very broke. That would be very sad, yeah. Need to make some money at least. All right, not too shabby. Is there any? Is there any anything annoying? No, the whole lobby is playing Ezreal again, just like always. It's not even the whole lobby. It's this. It's or not, not even half the lobby or anything. It's literally six people out of eight play Ezreal every game. And if you don't play Ezreal, you have no hopes of getting a first place. That's just the meta right now, guys. I do not make the rules. I see some YouTube comments saying, "Brother man, if you play Ezreal one more time, I'm gonna rip my hair out." You can rip all those, all that beautiful hair of yours out. Um, just like your mother gets rid of her hair downstairs because I like it bald. You feel me, guys? You feel me, guys? You gotta complain to Riot Games, not to me. I just play the game. If you wanna see ranked gameplay, that is in the sixth place. You wanna see Ezreal this patch. There is nothing else. There is nothing else, unfortunately, guys. Bra ruining YouTube video. Brother, that is that is literally the essence of the YouTube videos. No one would be watching if I didn't say that. No one's gonna watch if I don't say these things, man. That's just how it works. My, my whole career is built on these things. 
But I, I literally, guys. And then I zoom in on Kaisa and I'm like, oh, look at her toes, man. <laughs> Yummy. And people are like, lol, Shurko, you're so funny. <laughs> Surely you're joking. No, no, guys. I am really mentally ill. And I am really into feet, guys. And I'm gonna nibble on those toes. I do not give a frick. I'm gonna stand by it. And I hope she'll stand on me. You feel me, guys. We need to mark a new Cassante because we will need a Cassante eventually because I don't want even Trout on Cassante for the entire game, right? There is some spatula action going. Do I even want that? I don't think so. I don't think I want spatula. I think I really need to take this blue buff. <laughs> that is pretty silly. I am literally first pick with my augment and I have to take blue buff on a one cost, but I think Ezreal without blue buff is a piece of garbage. So it is what it is. Like spatula, what does spatula do? I don't even have belt. I don't even have a belt, guys. What does spatula do? You know what spatula does, guys? It ruins our item economy. It ruins our freaking item economy. But that means if I don't get a tier here, next carousel, I have to take a tier, right? If I take a spatula now. And then if I don't get a belt tier and no tier, then I have a useless spatula because next carousel, I have to either take a spatula or a tier for the blue buff. Probably for the blue buff, otherwise we lose every fight. So j just use your brain, guys. No offense, guys. Use your brain a little bit. You guys are losing the intelligence game against a freaking guy that just said he would nibble on Kaisa's toes. That is embarrassing, guys. You should be embarrassed. Because I know this Twitch chat is dumb as frick, spamming me to take the spatula. But use your brain a little bit and you will know it is absolutely wrong. You gotta think about your item economy. You gotta think about when you will complete those key I items. You gotta, you gotta get them done ASAP. You gotta think about what you're grabbing on the freaking carousel. You can only grab one item on every carousel, guys. Raise the stakes? Nah. Impossible, right? Impossible. Impossible to ra raise the stakes. Uh, like, I I'm too strong, right? This guy... This guy beats me. Like, honestly, both beat me. Frick it. Raise the stakes like a boss? I don't give a frick, guys. I frontline this mother trucker. Raise the stakes like a babus. Okay, honestly, this is not bad. Like, he's gonna die, but he's not gonna die instantly. He's gonna kill something. We're gonna kill some units. Yeah. Yeah, we're killing some units. Oh, we can kill that cannon. Oh, we can kill that Nico as well. The Cassante is gonna punch her like a boss. We didn't even kill cannon. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. I frontline because against the other guy, I would have to frontline, right? Are you at least happy now? Because I, I, I did a cool thing, raising the stakes, but I think it's actually correct. I think this is not a YouTube thing. I think it's actually the correct thing to do here. Might be wrong. Hopefully not. But I do need to go level 8 and roll, right? Honestly, though, do I have to go level 8 here? No. The thing is, Ezreal is so contested, so I kinda do, because otherwise I will never hit an Ezreal. That's the problem. But at the same time, I don't want to get rid of 5 hard steel. I can also just pivot into a different comp after after the stakes have been raised, right? I don't mind that. Well, I don't mind that, actually. We can just pivot into a different comp. We have a duplicator as well. Okay. Pentakill kill. Is that, does that make me too strong? Be honest, guys. Does that make me too strong? Remember, Aphelios is trash. This guy has Ilawi. He's going to beat me. This guy is pretty weak. I'll give it a buck. Oh, he got a Nico. He got a Nico though. This guy's strong enough. I'm gonna not focus his uh, ribbon. I don't want to focus his ribbon. This guy got a Nico. Is he strong enough though? I feel like he's weak. I think I cash out. And then I'm gonna surrender, no? That ruins the game. I think I'm gonna surrender. It actually ruins the game. I didn't expect him uh, to be that weak, you know? Like, he, he just ha has all his items on the bench for fun. Uh, 
That's why I don't raise the stakes and I'm really mad. UPIA, guys. I am extremely mad. I mean, I got armor and magic pen. It's not even that bad. Oh no, I already have armor pen though. Okay, I'm just gonna throw the game because I'm mad. Yep. It's just not fun anymore. Okay, these are. I don't think we want Jazz yet. I feel like we're too weak for Jazz. Yeah, we're, we're like, we're, we're, we don't have enough uh, juice for Jazz. I feel like Ginsu's is so bad on him. Might as well just give it to him. And then... Yeah. Ginsu's is so weak on Ezreal. Might as well just give it to the other guy. Oh, hey, can we cash out some cash outs and freaking uh, hatch the egg? Of course, now we fight against a giga strong enemy. Can you please kill this bard, you piece of garbage? Oh, right, nice. <gasps> the note was right here when he died. It was literally a centimeter away from him. That is wild, guys. <laughs> that was wild. Can we cash out hard steel? What do you think? Should I keep rolling here? Should I just I, I probably just donkey roll, right? If I can improve my team bit by bit, it's pretty good, no? I just go for a big shot. No, I mean not that I can really ditch anything. I, I would love to play Penta Kill somehow. I feel like we can't really do anything, right? I'm always gonna play five hard steel, I have 70 health. Can we beat this guy? <laughs> Man, I can't believe I lost that fight. I was hoping he would put Super Fan in, and then his Nico would get a Warmogs, man. But he just takes the Nico, and he's like, okay, I'll take the Nico. <laughs> cool guys, very fun. We love raising the stakes. I frontline my freaking Aphelios. I fight against the, the strongest player in the lobby. I don't frontline my Aphelios. I fight against the weakest player. UPI, yay, you guys. At least we have Ezreal, so it doesn't really matter. Doesn't even freaking matter, guys. Oh, we got it. All right, we got Infinity Edge and we got a Yurik. A Yurik. I could play Yorick instead of a Lucian. I would get much stronger. And then I could just put Ginsu's on the Ezreal. And you know what? I'm kind of down for that. What do you think, guys? And then we just go Ginsu's on him and freak it. Like, better, better to have a three-item guy than not have a three-item guy. And then who, who should I give this to? Do I give it to him? Loki, yeah, right? And I have Pentakill. Pentakill! Okay. I mean, this doesn't look bad to me. This doesn't look bad to me, guys. Oh, baby boy! Wait, we're cashing out Egg? Are you serious? Is Ezreal that OP? Wait, what? Nah, close, man. Close. I don't think he crit her, did he? I don't know. I would rather have this 2-star right now. Just want the power right now. Oh, that's a good one. Should I sell Ezreal? Because everyone's playing Ezreal, right? So it's kind of... I kind of don't want to sell Ezreal. Everyone's playing Ezreal, so I should hold Ezreal, right? Yeah, yeah, this guy found the freaking guy. What the freak is this, man? Okay, are we good? I, I don't think I'm selling Ezreal, bro. Also, there's a guy. 
But we don't even have the we don't have the thing thing. See the the, the problem with the egg is I I'm not sure if I'll hatch it, guys. But I'm cashing out heart steel now, and then I can roll down again and reduce to three heart steel. <laughs> if I find one Yorick, I have a two star Yorick. Oh, that was so close. She just barely survives. That's sad, bro. Wait, he's also golden egg. Oh no. We still need, we need three wins. We need three wins, then we'll hatch it. It has six stacks now. Cash out, we cannot raise the stakes here. Radiant Rabadons, you gotta be freaking kidding me, guys. I mean, I could put Radiant Rabadons on him. You know what, I'm gonna roll, I'm gonna roll first. Because if I find two star Kane, Radiant Rabadons is good on him. It's not even bad, yeah, for sure, actually, holy frick. I get a lifesteal item here, Radiant Rabadons. So I'm not gonna reforge yet, can you wait? We wait a teeny tiny bit, guys. Those are not lifesteal items, let me tell it. Let me tell y'all that. Let me tell y'all that. Okay. Okay, there's a Z. Okay, two star Z. Oh my goodly goodness, man. Oh my goodly goodness. <laughs> Oh yeah, how do I get a lifesteal item then? I just gotta get to reforging, right? What the frick is this, man? What the frick is this? What the frick is this? I already have heal reduction. I already have heal reduction. I just go Giant Slayer, I think. And I go lifesteal item later, I guess. I go lifesteal item later. What the frick was that? It was crazy. That was very unfortunate. And I go Warmox. Warmox on the guy. I'm gonna keep um, the Edgelord action for now. Usually you would of course play Bruiser, like uh, Zack and Zed and stuff. I'm gonna keep the Edgelords for now. Shall we? We're going Giant Slayer on him. He's gonna hit like a truck. He's gonna hit like a truck. And now we just need any lifesteal item. Hodge, Gunblade. Or Bloodthirster. Gunblade would actually be the best. Actually, probably Bloodthirster. Because they gave it AP as well now. Okay, so I need to survive three or... Yeah, three more. I'm putting him here so that Akali maybe doesn't ult him at the start. But he's gonna ult away anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Okay. Okay. My dude can also print uh, um, money, right? He can print money. He can print money. He already printed uh, one health point, by the way. Okay, nice. He printed money. Okay, so I need three more, three more things to survive. <laughs> Am I gonna lose? Am I gonna lose? <laughs> I mean, I just need to get a lifesteal item here. Just gotta grab a lifesteal item, no? Do I reduce hard steel? I think we should reduce hard steel, right? But the thing is, how do we even reduce hard steel? Like, we don't want to ditch this, this. We don't want to ditch this. We don't want to ditch. We want to ditch this, but we don't want to ditch this. So how do we even reduce hard steel? It's barely even worth. I guess I could put four hard steel, right? And I get the thing. Yeah. Makes sense to me. Four hard steel for now. Can I sell the Ezreals? Oh frick! I'm I'm getting freaking killed. Position him away. Oh, but he's gonna go in the back line and she's gonna get stunned. Okay, he did a lot of damage. Oh, he's gonna shave through them. Holy frick, we won a fight! <laughs> like, she gets stunned by the crowd divers. Crowd diver is a huge deal. We get a smaller cash out, but it's fine because we are cooking golden egg and we already have a radiant item. <laughs> I might actually win the game after I botched the freaking raise the stakes. Heart Seal Emblem, I don't want that. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, we got the Bloodthirster, the best one. They gave it AP now as well, 15 AP. So it's not worse than Gunblade, it's actually better because I just want him to stay alive. I don't care if he heals my team, I just want him to stay alive. Oh my god. And they're taking freaking Heartsteel Emblems, man. The frick is this? He doesn't even have Jazz, it's very greedy. Oh, he, he gets the Ilawi, right? He wanted Ilawi. Lowy, that's okay. 
Okay. And now, uh, do I keep rolling or do I just chill? Oh, wait, I already popped egg. I already popped egg. What the hell? Oh, my God. The freak is this, brother, man? Don't mind if I freaking do. Oh, my God. Hell yeah. And we have Jazz ready to be deployed like a babus. And I'm probably gonna win this fight, no? Probably gonna just win this fight. Oh, the cane is cooking, the cane is cooking, ult again, ult again. Yeah, the cane, the, the, the Ezreal finished the job. Oh my god, it's raining money, guys. It's Christmas. It is freaking Christmas, guys. I'm gonna sell it, you wanna... And then we cash out, then we get some more rewards, guys. Oh! It's not even bad. It's not even bad. I'll take the freaking dummy, man. <laughs> I'll take the support dummy. A gold augment. Four. Three. Don't mind if I do, brother man. Oh, brother man. <laughs> Holy frick, we're back, guys. No? Oh, my goodly goodness, we're back. And then we just go level nine. We play some Jazz action, we get this guy for 5 hard steel and Jazz, and I have 29 health left. Oh, ho, ho! it's freaking Christmas, man, look at this, look at this, look at this mother trucker. Look at this cane, guys. This cane is a beast. And then, do we even ditch Pentakill? Not really, bro, like, just keep this, man, just play Jazz and call it a day. Play Jazz instead of Kasante, play this guy. Play Jazz, call it a freaky day, man. Okay, honestly, this is Sentinel, though. Uh, okay, so how do I do this? How do I do this realistically? I think I just don't play Crowd Diver. I level up, I don't play Crowd Diver, I play this and this. That's about it, right? And then why am I holding this guy? It's Guardian, it's pretty nice, though. Do we move down to three? Three, we could ditch this guy for Kale. And then ditch Sentinel, get Edgelord anyway, without Yone. Crowd Diver is kind of nice though. I don't think I need Ionic Spark out of the thing. I think I just go uh, Z item. I have heal reduction from the augment. Okay, I mean I'm just leveling, and I gotta play Jazz, right? Okay, I, I, I just lost 50 trades. <laughs> I just lost 50 trades. Like, I'm playing Jazz for the price of 50 trades. And I lost Edgelord, by the way. But I mean, Edgelord doesn't do much, uh, doesn't make a difference on Kane. Because he just casts, right? He's just casting all the time. It does make him generate mana faster. So it's really not bad. <clears throat> We cannot go level 10 because the game's almost over. It's two more fights. Two more fights and the game's over. Alright, so how do we do this? This guy is pretty good. And then we want to play Yone somehow. Want to play Yone? We gotta play Yone somehow. But we, we really can't, huh? We really freaking can't. Isn't that true? I'm back to five hard steel frigate. I'm a genius. Get out of my face, brother man. I'm back to five hard steel. Just in case, right? In case we lose a fight, we'll get a bigger cash out, and then we'll definitely win the last fight. Oh, you lost to the dummy, you mother trucker. To a dummy. You lost to the Doomy, brother man, to the little Doomy, Doombo, you're a freaking dumb mother trucker, frick you man. It's the last fight unless we lose, and it looks like we'll lose this fight, no? So we'll get another cash out, and we're back. And then we can actually go level 9, no? And I just play this, call it a day. I get Guardian, no? I get Guardian and it's a 2 star. 
Yo, honestly, I probably just ditch five hard seal. If I lose this fight, I ditch five hard seal for sure. Also, I'm getting my cane solo focused like a freaking idiot. I just didn't move at all. Like an absolute degenerate. Pretty just win anyway. Kane is a beast. He dashed away like a boss. Oh, baby boy. We didn't even need to do anything at the end. Man, this Kane was some of like one of the best units I've ever had on my board, no? Ah, man, it is beautiful. Look, Ezreal, Ezreal. Two Ezreal players. They only have Ezreal 1. They still didn't go dead last. They went 5th and 6th. 3 star Samira, 3 star Amumu, 3 star Riven, 8, 7. Guys, please, please do not tell me not to play Ezreal. Another Ezreal player, well, he has Jin, but it's it's the same thing. It's the same thing, guys. It's Hearthsteel, Ezreal, he just didn't find Ezreal. Another Ezreal player. Hey, guys, this is just the meta, guys. We'll take it, though. I'm having fun playing this. It is what it is. Subscribe, ring the bell if you enjoy these TFT videos. Also, make sure to leave an algorithmic comment and an algorithmic like down below to support this video in the algorithm so I can get some more views. And I'll see you next time.